Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, or welcome if you're new. I am Sweet Ash Gamer, and today we are continuing again with The Sims 4 Tiny Town Challenge. So, we are going to be rolling our third sim. Uh, we have officially finished Gemma Stone's part, and we have also finished Mary Jane's part. And we are going to spin the wheel and find out whether we are playing with Kalissa, our painter, or if we are going to be playing with Charlie, our cook slash baker. Let's see. All right, here we go. Charlie or Kalissa. Oh, it looks like it's Charlie's turn. This is gonna be fun. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I'm actually doing this. So I am using the for rent thing. I went ahead and placed a little lot. I put it on the wrong side. We should actually be over here, but it's fine because we can change that. Let's go ahead and click on that and click create new household to move in. And then what we will do is we will add Charlie. Here's our Charlie. Let's look at his outfits. I'm not sure what I put him in, so it's going to be a surprise to me too. Uh, here is his fancy wear. His, oh, interesting outdoor wear. Ooh, his swimwear. His party wear. Oh my gosh. I did not put him in that. <laughs> that was his choice. Maybe we should change up his looks a little bit because... I don't know how he did that. There we go. That's a nice outfit. Uh, and swimwear is alright, I guess. Hot weather. Cute. Cold weather. Cute. Alright, I think that we are ready to start. So let's make sure that we have his favorite color set to red. And we are going to have his favorite activities as baking and cooking. Here we are with Mr. Charlie. Here is his lot over here. I forgot to show you guys that I went ahead with uh, Mary and used the rest of her money to make a little shopping area here. So this is where we're going to be selling our stuff. I think that it's super cute and will protect us from the weather and all that stuff. So that was pretty good. Uh, and now we are starting with Charlie. So I went ahead and I placed down a stove in the stuff that was originally here. If you remember in the first part, I think, uh, Judith burned all of this down. So that's not his problem. He wasn't here. So I went ahead and I replaced those things. And we are going to go ahead and start his little journey. I guess he's going to start with eating some yogurt because he's hungry. That's completely fine. Uh, but we need to be working on our cooking skills. So when you're done, we are going to cook and eat. I was going to say eat and sell. <laughs> hey, 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 Mary. Oh, I wanted to say hi. She left. That's okay. All right. Um, Is he actually going to go throw that away? I'm going to be amazed. What is he doing? Oh, how dare you? Oh, I hated that. Every moment of that was terrible. No, you need to actually do stuff now. Let's... I'm going to start with, wait, can we do this? You have insufficient funds. Oh, right, right, right. Come over here. Come over here, boy. You need to sell some of this stuff. So we have a little bit of money to get started. What's this? Vegetables and fruits. Let's go ahead and open these. I guess we can uh, start a garden for our food or whatever. If we end up needing these things. Okay, come over here, please. And I want you... You've got enough money now to... Do you have enough for a grand meal? No. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, I did hear that grand meals apparently sell for the most, so I was kind of hoping for that. Uh, no available fridge. Oh! Was there a fridge here? There might have been a fridge here. Alright, it looks like we can't actually cook without a fridge, so... Let's go ahead and grab a fridge then. I'm assuming... Alright, let's just give him the money for it. It's like, what, 200? Here we go. A little fridge for you. Um... I guess it must have had a fridge. How else would I be able to do this if I don't have a fridge? I don't know. So let's go... We'll start with making some brownies, I guess. Get that skill up a little bit. Everybody likes brownies, right? And we'll just make a whole bunch of brownies and maybe some waffles. See if people will will buy our waffles. Brownies and waffles. <laughs> Weird mixture, but they're both really good. So why is he not listening to me? Oh, he can't get in here. 
right right allow access to charlie i am so sorry you were kicked out of here i was trying to prevent people from burning the place down you know so that was kind of what that was about so now i know D don't you go in there burning things down charlie i have high expectations of you you are our baker slash cook our chef our goodie maker you better not burn down this kitchen <laughs> Because if you do, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what we would do. No idea. Maybe I had too much faith in him. No. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, uh, are you serious? No! Ah, oh, that was terrible. It it broke everything. Ah, oh. Charlie. Oh no, come over here and plant this stuff for me while I think about what we're gonna do. I suppose we... We're gonna have to sell these fruits and stuff, I guess, to be able to afford to fix that. Why are you breaking things? Oh, Charlie, you are terrible at this. Alright, please just plant the rest of that stuff. I'm gonna plant taro roots. No, mushrooms? Yeah, we'll plant some mushrooms as well. That sounds good. Uh, let's just sell the rest of this stuff, I guess. We don't need any of that. 50 bucks? That's nothing. That's nothing. Can we afford to replace this? 200. Can we still make stuff? Can we still make things? What if we just cook? There's no available fridge. <laughs> How much did- 200? Oh my gosh! Uh, I, can I put this somewhere else? I'm gonna put this in his inventory for now. I'm just gonna use the waffle. Wait, wait, wait. Can I just make waffles? With the- oh, Waffle time! <laughs> We're just gonna make a whole bunch of waffles and sell them. That's our only option right now. We're gonna make all our money off waffles until we can pay to fix the fridge that he caught on fire. And then we can sell other things. I'm very upset with him right now. <laughs> He's terrible. I mean, should we have seen that coming? Absolutely. Did I kind of foresee that? Absolutely. It was going to happen, right? But I didn't expect him to do it the very first time. I thought it was going to be in a couple of days when we've made a little bit of money and then he catches it on fire and we can replace it. But no, no. He had to do it in the very beginning to ensure that we wouldn't be able to do anything with this challenge right now. <sighs> What a jerk. <laughs> no, Charlie's sweet. <laughs> Charlie's sweet is sweet. It's fine. He didn't mean to do it. He's just terrible at cooking, I guess. We're just gonna have to practice. Charlie? Charlie, you... You forgot about your waffles, Charlie. Are you gonna... Maybe all of this community stuff was too much of a distraction. <laughs> Charlie! Charlie, come back! Your waffles are done, Charlie! Stop trying to watch movies! Come back! Okay, is that a train? Oh, that's traffic. <gasps> wow. I love seeing things in the background like that. Uh, wait, what are those? Are those cows? <gasps> those are cows! They're not moving. Why have I never seen that back there? That's so interesting. I love that. Okay, distracted. Sorry. Did you get the waffles? Yay! Come over here for me really quickly. We're gonna just throw this stuff in here. And I'm gonna have you come stock this table for me. And we're gonna have our first 10 o'clock brownies and waffles sale. Come one, come all. We got the brownies, we got the waffles, tend the table, come on. You're not gonna go up there? Okay, this is not gonna work this great if you're not actually gonna, 
There we go. Come on up. It's okay. It's okay. Start the yard sale. Yeah, come on, you guys. I know it's 10 o'clock, but I know you want some brownies and waffles. Buy your waffles for tomorrow. Have a late night snack. Nobody's coming. <laughs> he looked at me like, uh, <laughs> hi, Nancy. Would you like some brownies? Oh, grocery shop owner. Oh, no. She's like, I'm just coming to make sure you're not, like, reselling anything that you've bought from me or... Nope. Nope. We're good. We're just selling food that we've made. If you'd like to buy it, are you hungry? She is look like... Look, yeah, she's judging it. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I don't think she looks too impressed. Waffles? Waffles and brownies? What are we at? Zero percent? What's... One hundred percent? Oh, no. Wait, what just happened? Two dollars? Wait. Two dollars? What the heck just happened? I really just sold that for two dollars? Four dollars? What the heck? Alright, I marked up the prices. Do they individually buy them? Buy the whole pr buy the whole plate. I'm not selling individual brownies. <laughs> buy the whole thing. Kim, no? Please, just buy the brownies so I can go to bed and eat and go have my first pee in my pee bush. Okay. This is awkward. This is not sh this is not what should be happening here. Maybe the little enclosure for this wasn't the best idea. <laughs> because people aren't really using it the way that I thought they would. You're not supposed to be back here. Ooh, she bought it though. Thank you. $20. Well, we've learned that waffles and brownies don't sell very well. That is sad. <laughs> Go eat your yogurt. No, 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 no. Wait. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> if you want to take care of my plants, that's fine. I was about to say get off my lot, but like, you know, that's fine. <laughs> Alright, no, no, y'all can leave now, actually, because it's all over and everything, so... You can just leave. Wait, where's his pea bush? Where's his pea bush? He didn't get a pea bush? There's a pea bush over here. Hmm, take your pea bush. Why do I not have a pea bush? We'll share it. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll give it back to her when she needs it. My pea bush. I need it. <laughs> Go pee. Thank you. Can you just leave if you're not gonna help me? Oh! <gasps> Rain's here. Don't need you. Goodbye. Oh, gonna take a nice pee. And then we're gonna go to sleep. And 150. Let's see. No, we still don't have enough <laughs> to replace our refrigerator. Oh, no. Um, hmm. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I forgot about that part, guys. <laughs> this is a disaster. <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. I mean, it was broken anyways. Now we just have to repair everything. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, so we're going to have to get a roof over that stuff. Noted. I should have thought about that. Honestly, didn't expect rain so soon in the summer. I thought we were gonna have some nice sunny days, but I was wrong. So we're gonna have to do something about that in the morning. Hopefully he doesn't get electrocuted because he's got a lot of things to fix. Went ahead and put a little roof on this guy. Looks a little bit better. Hopefully uh, now we won't have to worry about the rain stuff, but still have to worry about whether or not he'll catch it all on fire. <laughs> uh, I went ahead and also put a little thing over the Thing here because you know the rain broke it as well so I want to protect it so he'll have to come over and maybe fix that or maybe actually we'll cancel fixing that so it'll stop continuously using it so much because <laughs> uh, you got other work to do you know after he's done repairing these we are going to attempt to make a little bit of money um, by 
cooking whatever we can. I guess a whole bunch of waffles. Waffles made us no money, though, so maybe we'll have to make something else. Yep. Oh, I was about to celebrate, but six dollars. Waffles are not the way to go. <laughs> we could not sell waffles. Actually, I'm... What is this? Fruit cake? I'll take that fruit cake. Can I sell it? Hold on, hold on. Can I sell their fruit cake? <laughs> hold on, I want to see if their fruit cake is worth anything. This would be funny real quick. Hold on. I stole their fruit cake. <laughs> and I'm going to sell it back. Anybody want to buy it? <laughs> this is terrible, but I have to make some money. I think I'm going to sell the waffle maker because obviously it's not it's not worth it. We need enough money to fix our refrigerator. Fruitcake! <laughs> you want to buy it? Sales pitch? Are you going to buy it? <gasps> oh! We made $100 off a of stolen fruitcake! <laughs> we can fix our fridge! <sighs> and get rid of this guy because he is useless. Bye-bye. And we'll just get rid of that because, um, yeah, it's burnt. And I don't want to replace it, so... Oh my gosh, so happy we can finally cook again. All right, come out here, and I want you... Uh, brownies are good, but what about if we... Can we cook a grand meal? We can. Let's try making a ham dinner, and then we will hold a sale, and we're going to see how much grand meals can make, because you do spend a lot of money on them, so hopefully they'll be worth a lot, right? Logically, right? Where are you going? Where are you going? Are you serious? <gasps> okay, you had a counter literally right next to you. Why do Sims do this? It makes me so angry. <laughs> Why? Cooking the dinner? Where? Why did you come all the way over here? Oh my gosh. All right. I'm mad at him now. <laughs> All right, we made a ham dinner and started a yard sale. So let's see how much these grand dinners are worth. I feel like Carly comes to every single one of our yard sales and I'm not sure she ever buys anything. So I feel like it's about time. You wanna buy this beautiful ham dinner? I mean, it is sitting out on a counter, and it's probably slowly going bad as we speak. If you would like to take it home and feed your kids dinner. A lovely ham dinner. Oh, are you gonna buy it? The mayor's walking up. Oh, $135. Okay. I had that at, at a 200% markup as well, so... Let's see, it costs $50 to do that. So I suppose we are making money off that. I was only, wait, no, it was $75 to do that. Let's try grand breakfasts instead. They're only $50, we'll make a whole bunch of them and then we'll do another yard sale and we see, we'll see how much money we can make off of that because I feel like it would be better to have a whole bunch of food to sell instead of just doing it one at a time like I have been, but I'm just, trying to kind of test to see what sells for what we've learned that waffles are a bad idea um but grand breakfasts could be great you know could be the best seller i guess we're gonna find out the only thing useful about rain oh 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 my oh man all right, this time we have a nice selection. Have been baking a lot. Got a matcha tea cake, some blueberry pie, some sugar cookies, some carrot cake cupcakes. What do you think? Harrison McMill McWilliams? That sounds like a fake name. The village mayor? I swear the mayor was a different guy yesterday. I think this guy is a scammer or something. What the heck? He's got a fake name and he's got a fake title. 
I met the mayor yesterday. You are not the mayor. Unless you killed him. <gasps> I swear he just said something about pie. I've got blueberry. Would you like some? <gasps> Yay, thank you. He bought the cookies. Cool. Thank you. He can't tend the table anymore because he's too uncomfortable. Oh no, that means I have to put all this stuff back in the fridge so it doesn't go bad and hope that nobody steals it. What is this? Gemma made a cake. Why did Gemma make a cake? I guess she got inspired. <laughs> uh, that's strange. And she left over at my house as well, which is actually kind of nice of her. Uh, put away. Let's go put that away and maybe we can also sell it. Interesting. I stopped her from getting into my fridge earlier because I thought she was going to steal the foods that I was making, but it turns out she just wanted to make something too. <laughs> That's kind of funny. All right, I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep. All you people, please leave. I will have another yard sale again tomorrow, um, and I will sell the same food that was here tonight. Sorry. All right, we've got a fridge full of goodies that we can sell, but unfortunately, Charlie is incredibly uncomfortable because he's a stinky boy. So I was wondering, we could, one, knock on one of our neighbor's doors and be like, hey, shower please, or maybe we could find somewhere else that we can shower. Wasn't there like a bathroom? Can you clean yourself in this bathroom is that possible we're gonna try that and if not then i'm just gonna come down here you got a good idea i'm gonna come down here and too uncomfortable to swim well the entire point was to clean you boy what the heck too uncomfortable to swim oh my gosh can i harvest all this stuff harvest too uncomfortable gosh dang it charlie you need to get un un comfortable you need to get re-comfortable go do whatever you need to do hopefully this bathroom like does our hygiene good oh it did it terrible oh <laughs> should have known better a public bathroom helping with your hygiene ha <laughs> hilarious okay my bad can you please go jump in this water really though really really tip, tip, tip. oh Nope, he's just gonna try to impress absolutely nobody right now. I don't really know what to do. <laughs> that was my idea for getting him less stinky, was to make him go, uh, <laughs> go swim. But he's like, no, I don't, I, I don't actually want to swim. All right, fine. Let's go put all this stuff back in here. And we are going to attempt to sell it. Can we actually sell that? No, we can't sell the cake she made. That's unfortunate, but that's okay because it gives us something to eat. Hopefully he will still do this even though if they don't stop with those alerts, they they freaking scare the crap out of me, especially the school ones. I hate that. <laughs> okay, will you? No, he will not tend the table. He said, I am too uncomfortable to do so. Ugh, but we just put all this food out. All right, fine, fine, fine. Let's just put it all back in the table and hopefully it'll stay good. How long does it stay good in the table? Six days, six days, 15 days. Oh, we should be storing it in the table. I wonder if Sims will take food out of that table and attempt to eat it or not, because if not, that could be the solution that we need. Uh, why don't you just come over here and grab yourself something to eat because you are hungry. All the loud notifications, love that. Um, I am going to try to make him comfortable enough that he will go swim in the lake and get some of this uh, nastiness off him. So let's try to get him more comfortable. Well, I suppose it's helping a little. We might have to swim around all day. <laughs> get the stench off him. Uh, should we take our clothes off? Should we be skinny dipping? Maybe if we skinny dip, that'll, you know... Get the grossness off you faster? That could be a good idea. Why don't you come back and uh, let's skinny dip instead. Maybe maybe a lot of work faster. No, nope, doesn't seem to be any better. Cecilia is calling. I'm naked in the pond. I don't know how I just answered your phone call, but uh... <laughs> Alright, 
Alright, well this is a nice view. Beautiful. I think that we're just gonna sit here and let him swim around naked and attempt to, uh, clean himself. <laughs> it was pretty disgusting. Well, I may be stinky, but I can promise you that my pies are not stinky basic style. Okay, <laughs> I don't really care. My pies are tasty! <laughs> oh no! You're supposed to be sniffing and sniffing my pies, not me! <laughs> Come on, you guys! Should I... I'll mark down the prices. A hundred. Please. Please, guys. Are you gonna buy something? This is the... Huh. I guess that was the village mayor. He just came over in a different outfit yesterday, and he looked entirely different. Didn't have his mayor outfit on, and I was like, You're not the mayor! You're a liar! <laughs> Hi, you sweeney. Oh, that's close. Charlie Sweet. You could be sweet, sweetie. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Okay. Can you guys actually stop hanging out? And I kind of need... Kind of need some money, guys. Kind of need some money. Thank you! I don't know what she just... Oh, thank you! I don't know what was just bought. But thank you! <laughs> We're actually making a little bit of money now. This is great. I uh, Apologies, Mayor. Um, you know, yesterday I was... I was having a little bit of an off day. I just, you know, you didn't have on your lovely gold medal, so I was like, that is a fake mayor? <laughs> Not the real one! Alright. If you guys would kindly buy my food so I can get started on, like, perhaps a bathroom. A shower would be lovely. Please. <laughs> guys. Oh, now that it's raining, everybody's like, hold on, let me just buy everything. We have 1300 Yay! Oh my gosh, this is going great. This is going great. Can you guys buy more? I just have two more to sell. Two more to sell and we can all leave. I'm holding you hostage. <laughs> you guys can't leave until I'm out of stuff. Let's go. Come on. No, no, you can't leave. No, come on. Go back and tend the tip. Too uncomfortable. Yeah, because you're standing in the rain. Come here. Get out of the rain. Oh my gosh. All right, let's uh, change your clothes really quickly. Stop it, stop it, stop! Stop! Go back over here, do what I tell you. Are you feeling better now? Can you? Okay, it looks like our yard sale is over. He's being a little baby. He's being a little baby, you can't hold his pee. And oh my gosh, his, his knees are really bad. All right, go use the bathroom. Go grab yourself something to eat. Oh my gosh, then you can go to sleep or whatever because you need to sleep because it's 3 a.m. and you don't need <laughs> All right, I'm sorry, Charlie. We'll take better care of you. We'll get a shower soon. You got to do what I say. Go use the bathroom. Oh, he peed himself. Really? Really? Did he pee himself? He made the noise like he peed himself, but then he didn't actually pee himself, so I don't know what just happened. But whenever you're done, take care of yourself, eat something, drink something, go to sleep, and then we'll start to- wait, 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 actually, shower. Eat something and then shower. This is perfect. Thank you, rain. Thank you, nature. What is all that? Oh, he wanted to shower first. That's fine. No, you didn't finish your shower. You still stay- oh my gosh. Ugh. Just shower. Shower first. Shower. Shower! Charlie! Shower! Stop! Shower! Charlie! Finish showering! It's not gonna be raining anymore! Oh my gosh. Uh, 
He ignored everything I said. What do I do with all these clothes? Am I no, he's not a glutton. This is the first. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Leave me alone. Fine, go to sleep. He's like, no, I'm just gonna pass out in front of the tent instead. <laughs> I'm dying right now. <laughs> I didn't expect this one to be so hard. Honestly, I thought cooking was gonna be easy. I mean, I knew we'd probably have a couple fires, but Charlie is struggling. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny though our first male sim is like having such a hard time the girls breeze through they were like we got this he's like what are you doing to me this is torture <laughs> i'm so sorry go to sleep charlie you'll be okay i feel like maybe you should not put the tofurkey next to the turkey whenever you're trying to advertise here <laughs> you know but uh, cause that looks really unappetizing next to that. But could you go ahead and still buy it, please? After we finish our yard sale with this today, we are going to start on our house. So that's exciting. We got a little bit of money. Just trying to make a little bit more. Come on, guys. All that's left is the grand meals. Those should sell for a lot at this point. Please buy them. We've hit 2,000 already. Very happy and excited about that. Yes, another one sold. Come on, more, 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 guys. Come on, more. Buy more. Please. That took all night till 2 a.m. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad. Go over here, use the bathroom, make yourself something to eat. And then I suppose go to sleep. And tomorrow we will start building his tiny home. All right, it is time to finally get started with this. Let's get rid of all of the stuff that we don't need in the area. All right, get rid of that as well. We can move those off the lot a little bit. Move that back, move that back. All right, so if we, let's go ahead and put this in our inventory and let's pull this guy over here. Perfect, thank you. All right, we can put this bush over here. We might be able to get rid of the bush today, uh, but we are going to first figure out uh, how big this is going to be. So how much room do we have? We have, enough for at least that that's one room here perfect it's not shared it is charlie's and we can go ahead and put i don't need to put a roof on it i guess we could here we go look at that <laughs> oh my gosh that roof looks so funny uh let's go ahead and give him a door does he have enough for more than this all right, let's go see how much a shower costs. I feel bad, like, just giving him this tiny little room after all the work he's done, but... 300, okay. Oh, okay, so that's a little bit of money. Let's see if we can afford to also get a toilet. Wouldn't that be nice? Yeah, a toilet, and maybe we can even get a sink in here. We can have a full bathroom. We can, of course, you know, get the better stuff whenever we can afford it. All right, let's get a door in here. Need some sort of door, some sort of way to get into the bathroom. Um, let's go ahead and... Is there a red door of this? Look at that, a red door. Oh, that's kind of creepy, red door. <laughs> uh, we put the things on this to make that look a little less weird. We'll, of course, change this a lot later. Uh, but for now, that's just what it's going to be. Um, should we go ahead and just, like, make bricks or something? There we go. <laughs> uh, a tiny little brick bathroom. And probably put a light in here. That way you can see what he's doing at the very least. There we go. That's a lot better. Alright, now he has somewhere to shower and stuff. So that is very, very helpful. Even though it's just the tiniest little shack, we still have a thousand dollars. So, like, in theory, 
I might be able to give him a little bit more, but also a thousand dollars isn't going to do much and we kind of need a little bit of money to continue with cooking and making these grand meals. So I'm going to have him take a shower and feel a little bit better and then start on some more cooking. His cooking skill has gotten to level six. So no more fires, hopefully. Uh, he's doing pretty good. I'm sure he's very ecstatic to finally have a bathroom. Hey, progress is progress. He didn't have a bathroom yesterday. He had no ability to take a shower up until about 10 minutes ago. So I feel like that's, <laughs> that's a lot of progress. We have a whole ass bathroom. All right. Um, we don't have anything that we can currently sell, so we're kind of stuck at the amount that we have. But I could have him cook up a bunch of stuff and sell some more things so we could expand the house. But I don't think a thousand is enough yet, so uh, I guess we won't do that just yet. Alright, so I went ahead and made like a little hill here. I thought that'd be really cute. I want to see how much of a house we can actually build like this. So I'm going to go ahead and place that down. This could be maybe the front door instead, like that, perhaps. And then we could have some siding for this here. There we go. We officially have the start to his little house. We went ahead and made this the kitchen. There's literally no room in here. Off to the side, we got a little bathroom. That is the beginning of his starter house. I think we're gonna build it out and up a little. This will probably be a little separate thing that we keep and make a second story to. But I think it looks really cute so far. I've decorated with a whole bunch of red flowers, as you can see, since his color is red. Uh, he'll probably have like red furniture and stuff like that, but I'm really, really excited for this. He's going to nap in his tent. Unfortunately, no bed yet, but 500 simoleons. I think that a few, oh, like a dozen grand meals could get us a finished house potentially. I don't know, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this here and we will continue in the next part on Charlie's adventure of having a finished tiny house. We don't have much left to do, but he does need, obviously, a living room, a proper kitchen, a bedroom, and we need to finish all of that. But I'm going to go ahead and leave this part here. So I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.